Hello, the internet. Welcome back to the Webhus. I'm Sefi, and today I want to talk a little bit about how the meta is changing, how everything is shifting a little bit in terms of research management when it comes to the treasures, or since the treasures were released, favorite items, whatever you want to call them, right? So I want to talk today about wiping out, about the discounted pools, and about dispatch missions and refreshing. Usually, what we uh, used to recommend most people is you either do double wipeout so you do your free one and then you do 50 and 70 right or you do your 150 discounted pool if you are before the 160 wall if you are still below that level if you are still a stack you do at uh, this discounted pool right because it's pretty good it's pretty good and you'll be able to get plenty of ssrs over time uh, it's really nice even for lower spenders i recommend doing that but wiping out now it's losing some value for the amount of cordas you're getting because now we can get treasure boxes. Now we can get actually this collection item milliage boxes, which have a 3% chance of, the, of giving us a purple doll and a 13% chance of giving us a blue doll. Well, of course, this is per doll. You can actually zoom to see the, the total of purples and blues. So this is really important. This is the difference between a character being on the top of your list or a character losing a lot of combat power. And the difference is really huge because the, combat, the increased combat power you're getting, the increased raw stats this is a purple assault rifle phase one so sorry phase zero level zero right not leveled up not done anything and scarlet is getting 94,000 hp 3000 attack 600 hp as uh, a defense and then she's getting damage deal when attacking core 10 percent defense increase as well damage taken reduce and cover max hp 12 percent this is important and this is important for everything. It doesn't matter if it's PvP, it doesn't matter if it's gonna be solo raids, junior raids, long term. The difference between the people who are actually giving or getting better scores is who has more meta units invested with those treasures. So I will say stop wiping out. If you're a free to play player, if you're a light spender, stop wiping out because now it's better that you actually refresh your dispatch missions. Now, Wells, since day one, have been doing this. They refresh until they get perfect core dust in here. They go one by one. And they refresh and they get cordas. Now this is changing. So what do you want to do? First of all, your favorite item, you want to dispatch this one. Now, important. Of course, you want your collection item millage boxes. 100% dispatch this one. These gold boxes are really good, but these ones are better because this is directly elite. So I will say you can go for both. The ones that are going to give you a random one, even though it's only a 10%. A 10% is a pretty good chance. We're gambling addicts, okay? We're gambling addicts. So I will say golden boxes always get... And that's it. You want to stop. You don't want to do care about the blue ones right now. You also want to go, of course, for your gems because this means you are reimbursing some of these costs, right? If refreshing costs me, let's say, uh, 50 gems, right? And I'm getting back in here 75, then this is pretty good. This is pretty good. So as you can see, I am left with only these missions right here. What you want to do is do a refresh for 50 gems. And we got pretty unlucky when it comes to at least getting that. So what I will do now is go for my core dust, go for my 15 gems. So again, get some back. And I would only recommend doing this twice. I would not recommend doing this three, four, five, six, seven times because this gets expensive really quickly if you're doing it every day. For Wells, again, they're going to be doing this. But for most of you, I would recommend only twice. If you get unlucky on the second time, then you can probably stop. We got lucky this time, so we can just do this. After you do this, you cannot get more. Even if you were to refresh more, and I'm going to refresh once more so you guys can see this, you will not be able to get more. Your slots are decided by this icon here. So per day, you will get your favorite, and then you can get up to four items. Nothing else. So it's not worth refreshing further if you didn't get more. So I will go for these golden boxes, and I will go, of course, for the collection item milliage box. Because... Again, this is going to be the difference in the upcoming solo raids between the top 100 or actually being able to get fit into that 3% for the big frame in solo raid or staying outside because you're not properly investing. When it comes to what units should you prioritize, of course, it's going to be the meta ones. <laughs> When we talk about meta, first your DPS units, then your supports, right? So, first you're going to go for Scarlet Black Shadow, Alice, Red Hood, Maxwell, Scarlet, Dorothy, Ludmilla, 2B if you want to put 2B, even though not nowadays, but all of your DPS is first, and then you're going to go for your supports. When it comes to maintaining items, you should also start first with the DPSs. Now, the important part, you might be thinking, but how do we know if the, the treasures for characters are going to be good 
or not. Sadly, this is going to take a long time for people to start figuring out what treasures are good or until Wells can actually test all of them. So I am going to be investing all my resources into the characters with the treasures. It's kind of fucking up or breaking my account, but let's be honest. Let's be real for a second here, all right? I cannot break my account much more after having a fully invested Pascal. I cannot break my account much more after you guys made me also invest in Crow. <laughs> At least Crow, I could get the, the skills back. Uh, Pascal for now stays at the 10 until the next reset. But yes, I wanted to make a short video talking about this. You should stop doing wipeouts, in my opinion. You should start doing double refresh on your dispatch missions. And if you are a light spender or you are before the 160 wall, ignore that and only do the 150 discounted pool. Again, only if you are below the 160 or you are a spender. I do this every day because I spend more money. And that said, for those of you interested on the reviews for Soda and Alice, they are already on the website, both on the tier list. Tomorrow I'll make a video. Uh, I will make two videos, one like a short version, two minute, one two minute video on Alice on how good or bad she is. And then a more detailed explanation on a couple of things that are interesting, mostly about the books that right now we are finding like a sky phone that we are finding with Tove and the, the interactions on the boobs so if you're interested leave a like subscribe have a good channel boss so that's gonna be it for this one though short one no stream today we only do like a couple hour stream i'm gonna go to batch soon right i was just playing gachas in fact i'm playing a new korean gacha it's not new it's been out for a while uh, last year came out it's trical it's pretty fun it's pretty cute see i would say uh gacha nothing in terms of big uh, mommy wife right we have nick for that but yeah it's gonna be for this one short video love you all bosses thank you to my patrons for making this content possible as usual good luck with your pool dinner it's i'll see you in the next one